was it was pretty good, you know. They made noise when it counted in the second half, and I think they helped us. And if it, if this is a a small taste of what's coming, then you know it's going to be great for us. So uh, very appreciative of the fans that came and uh, the support they gave us, and we're looking forward to the next tiers being filled in here and uh, getting even more help. How about the effort this time against Turkey? Much better, much better, but not good enough. Um, we still. We still have room for improvement. Uh, we still have time to work on that. Um, we expect that uh, France will present some different problems than Turkey, but uh, obviously, you know, lessons are learned and uh, improvement was made. There were some loose turnovers in the game, and uh, and we missed too many free throws. So, uh, you know, if we can if we can do a little bit better job of taking care of that, I think that uh, you know we can tighten that score up even further and. And have a chance to win the game. That's what we're we're intending to do. Because certainly Turkey is here to win this thing. They've made that perfectly clear in their preparation. They've made that clear in their selections. And uh, you know they're a real strong team. So this is a good good gauge for I think you know, how much we've improved. But uh, there's still a lot more work to do. Uh, execution so much better. Both ends of the floor. And still defensively we're reacting a little bit rather than scheming. Uh, we have to scheme better. But there was big improvements in our schemes. Uh, but we still get caught sometimes uh, making wrong rotations. And there's just too many, uh, there's too many habits that we have that, uh, that are generated from Philippine basketball that uh, you know, they're going to hurt you when you're playing against the European sides because they'll exploit it. And, uh, you know, overcoming those habits in the short time frame that we have is, is a super challenge. It's, uh, and uh, yeah, I'd like to say that you know it's all mental, but you know, every single one of us has bad habits. And you know, that sometimes you know you're not supposed to do something, but habit takes you where you're not supposed to go. And uh, we still suffer from that. And whether we can fix that in, in four days, to some degree we have to. But to some degree, we have to, you know, we have to play our tails off because we're going to make mistakes. Unfortunately, it's just, it's just the nature of the beast. And uh, you know, another couple of months together, and I'm sure we could iron out a lot of these bad habits. But we aren't going to have that. Which four days before the tournament, uh, can you talk about the overall mood of the team? Uh, much better, but I don't, I don't really want them to feel good. Um, I want them to understand that. Uh, you know, this was a taste of improvement tonight. This is a, a step much closer to the goal that we have, but we're not there. And we can't kid ourselves that just by being better, we're good enough, and we're not. So uh, we don't want to feel good. We don't want to feel relaxed. We don't want to feel comfortable. Um, it's not what, what anybody wants in the Philippines. We want to win. But uh, you can see that even when we put in a really good performance, even when players that you know a lot of people question step up and play good basketball, you look at the plus minuses of the players. I hope everybody takes note of the plus minuses of the players. Um, it's still not there. And so uh, you know, we believe in this team. We believe in the last steps that we have to take. But uh, we have to be incredibly uncompromising with ourselves. The main word that I wrote on the board before the game and the word that I emphasized after the game was accountability because we just don't have a margin for error. And those of us that make mistakes, they, they you know, the impact of our mistakes is much greater than the impact of a mistake that Turkey or France will make because they're going to make so many great plays. Look at the play Guler hit at the end of the halftime. You know, they have guys that can make those. Do that on a regular basis. We really can't. We really can't. So um, we have to play extremely well. We have to make our opponent play poorly, and this is really tough to do. But this is our task.